Hi guys. Um, here is uh, a high Alpha again that um, has uh, issues with the slide lock mechanism. Okay, just to show you that um, what slide lock is. Slide lock meaning if there is no BB, it will uh, supposedly uh, lock the slide through this uh, part. Okay, because the magazine uh, is a ma magazine follower, which is this part. Okay, is pushing up the sli slide lock uh, for it to uh, make or position the slide at the rear in this case. Okay, so, but it's not. So we will show you how uh, to solve that one. Okay, supposedly yes, it's uh, working. Sometimes uh, it's not. You see, it's not working at times. We will show you how. We'll be back. Uh, slide lock uh, part. So to simulate it, we will insert this uh, a mag that's empty. Uh, there's no BB inside it. Okay. So it should supposedly push automatically uh, to that position. Okay, so that it will um, uh, block the slide from pushing back uh, a new round. Okay. So, we will show you that uh, sometimes this part, this protruding part, okay. see that protruding part? It will uh, prevent from uh, pushing upwards. Okay, see this protruding part that uh, that's not helping at all. Uh, sometimes uh, maybe we can can uh, eliminate this. Uh, just like the slide of a uh, or the slide lock of the uh, the real steel version it doesn't have this anyway there's a plunger okay this is a plunger it is uh, spring loaded it pushes the B, uh, the slide lock from moving upwards okay uh, as long as uh, it's in normal operation and uh, there is still a bb it should not um, move upwards okay so we will uh, file this off and smoothen it a bit and uh, we'll be back hi guys we're back we actually did two things uh, for this as you can see um, the bulge uh, we actually smoothened the bulge on this part and at the same time we have uh, we slightly filed this portion or in it will have a biting a more biting effect uh, uh, to the angle of the slide okay sometimes this part this corner sometimes will wear off or in it will have a um, wear and tear 
uh, on this part here wherein it won't engage properly with the slide okay so that's how I do it it's just like a few uh, filing strokes using this triangular uh, small file okay so that's how I do it guys so we'll assemble back the gun and we'll see how it's uh, well, what's the what are the effects of it okay so we'll assemble back See that guys so we will see if uh, that has or that solves the problem see that guys so that's how we do it when the fixing and uh, the timing of this uh, of this uh, gun or so it's it actually can be done to 1911 platforms high cover pistols okay so i hope you enjoy this video guys and we hope to see you soon in the next tutorial guides bye now hi guys uh just a bonus to you all okay so here is uh what i do you can see there uh, file marks right okay so this is a bonus part wherein we just uh, color it back since this is um, a black or dark gray uh, finish I will have to use a coloring pen or maybe a pencil pen to color it back okay this is what I learned when uh, I was uh, starting to tinker my own firearm wherein I filed some parts and it's a hassle for me to have it colored back to maybe powder coat or blue blue finish okay so this uh, what I do just uh, for you all okay so after I color it I I install it back okay so just uh, nothing happens okay so just to check the functionality, we will assemble it back. Okay. There we go, guys. So that's all for today. Thank you for watching, guys. Bye.